Hi, so got face ID has been disabled the problem on her iPhone after updating iOS 17. Hi there, this is Joy and here is how to solve face ID has been disabled the problem on her iPhone with updating iOS 17. If you solve the problem guys, here are a couple of things that you guys have to follow. First, all you have to do, you have to head over to your app store and tap search and type hardware test. Now the reason for you to search this application is because this application will find out whether this problem is happening for hardware or software. If you open this up here and then you have to scroll down and tap face ID test, tap here again and tap begin test and just try to check whether it works or not. So as you guys can see it's not working here, that could potentially mean it's the problem with the hardware itself. Now if it's the problem with the hardware then you know, of course you got to take your device to Apple here. Before you do that here are a couple more things that you guys can try. You can head over to your settings and you can scroll down to your accessibility there and you can tap on this face ID and attention. Now make sure these three options are enabled. For some reason, if you see all are disabled, and all you gotta do here, just make sure to just enable it from here so that you can actually solve your problem for a device. So if it's disabled, just simply enter your passcode to enable it. I mean, you have to do it for every um, section there, attention for a features and stuff. And after doing this, now let's go ahead and check your problems. Now, even after that, if you still have problems, get out of here, reopen it shit, and then just reopen up your settings. Uh, you want to scroll down in screen time, open up your screen time, make sure to disable the content and privacy restrictions. Sometime, if you enable this option here, this can actually give you a little bit of problem with the true depth camera and potentially it can lead you to have bad problems. So disable it get back here and check your ratio again if you have problems uh just open up your face id and passcode here first if you already set up your face id now say just um scroll down here and just try to reset your face id or if you haven't set it up yet then i would say just i'll uh, try to set up your face id again and check whether it is actually working for you or not at the same time, all you want to do is just, uh, so I've done from the top here, tap and hold the brightness slider and make sure the true tone is actually one for your iPhone. Now, once you're just doing all the process, now head over and check whether you got the problem solved or not. If you still have problems, uh, the last two things that you guys can do on your iPhone, you can head over to settings on your iPhone there, you can open up your general and tap software update. And if you see there's a new software available for your device, I highly, highly, highly recommend you guys to update your iPhone to check whether the problem is going to be solved or not. So if none of those work, before you take your device to the Apple Care, head over to settings one more time, scroll down to general and scroll down again, tap transfer, reset and choose erase all. Remember, this is going to delete all of that information that you might have on your iPhone. Just try to get a backup on your computer or your iPhone. And after that, just check whether the problem is going to be solved or not. Well, if none of those help you out, guys, now you have nothing to do. You, of course, you got to take your device on the Apple here and hopefully they will solve the problem for yourself. And that's how you guys can solve your problem for your device as well. I find this video useful. If you think so, it does help you out. Anyways, please be sure to leave the like and subscribe to the channel. I'll see you guys again and have a good day.